Hey, I'm Roger. Today I'm going to show you how to install our battery onto our bikes. Today we're going to show you with the G2 battery, but this applies to all our batteries. Notice a little notch right here, well, like a little part sticking out here, and then you got this right here. You want to line this up to the lower dock. Before you uh, put the battery in, you're going to want to turn it on. Hold the button down, make sure it's illuminated. Now, line up the notch here with the lower dock. Turn the key. Use a little force, slam it in. Turn the key this way. Double check to make sure it's in there well and should be good to go. If you're having a little bit of trouble getting your battery in, I have a tip for you. Um, go ahead, line up this notch with the lower dock. Turn the key, but now lift the battery up a little bit like this. So kind of lift it up and then slam it in like that. Turn the key, double check it. We're getting a lot of questions about leaving our G2 batteries on since the button is recessed in there once it's locked in. Um, you can go ahead and do that. Uh, you could just turn it off with through the LCD instead of you know trying to turn the battery off, taking it out and turning it off um, that way. If you are going to be using your bike, like say once or twice a week, then I would just say leave it on. The battery is going to go into a sleep state. It's not going to be draining very much energy at all. Um, and then I'll go ahead and charge it too while it's on the bike. Um, if you are going to store the bike for a while or not use it for like a month or two, um, then I would say yes, uh, take the battery out, turn the button off, and then you can store it either off the bike or onto the bike that way. But leaving it on for you know a short period of time or whatever is not a problem at all. If you have any questions about installing your battery, leave a comment below. And thanks for watching.